Hello everyone, it's Claudia here, and today I am back with a new process video using the Scrapbook Circle March 2017 kits. So as you can see, I had already cut some of the papers uh, before I started recording, and the reason I did that is because um, when I was making this layout, the lighting was really bad, and it's probably still not too good during this video, but it was kind of, um, you know, the reason why I was thinking that I wasn't going to do a process video and then um, when I started creating I thought you know maybe the lighting isn't going to be too bad and maybe I should just record one and then after that I can always you know decide to not upload it if it's really not um, anything um, that you can watch without you know being annoyed at the quality and maybe you know like I said it's still not the greatest but I think it should be okay and as always there will be some uh, high quality photos at the end of the video so right now I am going to start working on my layers and uh, this paper with the orange stripe is from the Amy Tangerine on the Wind collection and I have to admit that orange is not my favorite color um, I'm not really sure why I feel like I don't know I just prefer pink but um, I felt like it was okay to have a little pop of that orange because there is a little bit of orange um, in that background paper with all the hearts so I thought that that would be a nice um, way to kind of complement that in my layering. So right now I'm flipping through the 6x6 paper pad which came in um, one of the add-ons this month and I believe it's called Have Fun and one of the things I really really like about these scrapbook circle add-ons is that um, a lot of the times um, it will have a 6x6 paper pad which in my opinion is really great because you can do so many things with a 6x6 paper pad you know first of all you know it gives you a lot of you know different patterns to work with rather than just the papers you get in the main kit and also uh, if you have a um, silhouette you could you know use cut files on that and um, you know get a lot of use out of it so initially I wasn't planning on using this a scalloped border paper from the Paige Evans and Pink Paisley's Oh My Heart collection but as I was creating the layout I thought that maybe it would look pretty nice and it would you know be cool to add so um, I'm cutting one of them out and you can even see it um, honestly this took a while so I'm not going to um, make you sit and watch me through the whole thing so in a second here we'll skip ahead but I'm just showing you the first one and off screen I actually cut out another one, uh, one of the yellow ones, and put it um, on the layout, which you will see in the close-ups coming up towards the end. And um, the reason I did that off-camera is because I didn't know if my phone <laughs> was going to die on me because it's old and you know the battery life it, it drains quite quickly when I'm recording. So I just figured I would just do it off-screen, and it doesn't really matter too much. Um, so as you just saw, we just skipped ahead. I, you know, had cut out another one of those scallop borders and had stuck it down. And now I'm going to start working on my embellishing. And I really like this sticker book from the new Chamel Little by Little collection, just because you have so many options. You know, there's cardstock stickers, there's some washi stickers, some clear ones, and you know, there's also some mini alphas and stuff. So there's a lot of different things you can use, which I really like. And I think I said it in my haul video as well, but that bear that is holding like that flag that says perfect day or whatever, I think that's so perfect for like a card, so maybe I'll make a card with it. Um, these puppy stickers also came in the add-on that had the 6x6 paper pad, so um, a lot of the stuff I'm using is from the 6 paper, 6 by, um, excuse me, I'm totally stirring my words right now, from the add-on, um, just because it had some items from the um, Oh My Heart collection which I really really like and since I'm on a spending freeze I don't think I'm going to buy it on my own so I will have to make do with anything I can get in a kit and these flowers I'm playing around with are also uh, from the collection um, I cut them out of the 6x6 paper that came in that paper pad and um, yeah I'm just going to stick these down like you know it's probably a good idea to stick them down and I'm going to add another puffy floral just because you know I love my florals you can never have enough florals on a page 
Um, I do think I end up changing that blue heart back for the T1 that I just switched it for, so yeah, I was a bit indecisive on that one. And I knew I wanted to use these puffy uh, stickers from the Fancy Pants Joy Parade collection designed by Kim Watson because of the amazing, which uh, the pink on that matched really well with the pink that's in the Old My Heart collection, so I knew I wanted to use that as part of my title. And um, it's completely crooked, and I was supposed to fix it, but I haven't fixed it yet. So uh, in the close-ups, you're not going to see it straight, but I will try and remember to fix it. So um, originally my title was going to be Amazing Day, but I do actually wind up changing that for um, a puppy sticker that says Life. So it's going to be Amazing Life, and the day is just going to go back on a sticker sheet. And I will add some gold splatters to finish it off. And that is basically it. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to check out these scrapbook circle kits if you haven't done so already. And I'll be back with more videos soon. Have a great day. Bye.